All right, so one cool feature about Desmos is you can actually do regressions, which is kind of neat. So if I insert a table, whoops, not a folder. If I insert a table, um, I'm just going to make up a bunch of numbers. We'll do some out of order, too. Whoops. Let's do like a mm, negative one. And so if I say... Um, Do some there a little bit out of uh, uh, negative three. We'll change this to seven. Now we'll change this to eleven. Okay. So let me move my face. So I have this thing here. Now it's almost linear. Um, I purposefully changed some values around. But if I wanted to do a linear regression on that, um, that's pretty easy to do. I'm just going to go up here. And when I click on this, I, that's how you add the regression. And so um, you can click on it, and you can change the regression, too. So you could do, like, a power regression. Um, but that's basically it. And then it gives you all the information. Um, you get your R squared value, your R value, and you can plot residuals if you want and stuff. So um, like that. So anyways, that's it. That's how you do it.